Hi, welcome. We are on a particular machine. Do you will see that the noise is a little bit less and that the resolution is smaller. We are on an old MacBook Pro with an NVIDIA card, GeForce 9400. We are also on LXUT, the latest desktop, so we are trying it out on all our systems here. And um, one of the guys asked on YouTube, Eric, is it possible to go via Wi-Fi and install Arco Linux that way, not with a LAN cable? We've always told everybody it's just easier. Plug in the LAN cable. It's just not worth it's all the trouble and all the technicality. But I have some time left over. I have here a laptop in front of me, a dual screen in the back, and in the back we have here the wiki archlinux.org index.php wireless network configuration. So I have here nothing really, I can connect, yes, but I mean, the thing is, he wants to connect, um, I suppose, with Wi Fi menu and stuff like that. So we can graphically just choose one of these uh, of these uh, wireless how do you call that well icons right and put in your password and you're done that's easy enough for me but i think it's a more difficult kind of approach to do this via wi-fi menu via Arch linux d or something or maybe it's an arch linux question i'm not sure i'm not really not sure but we can have a look. So I have now two mouse here, one, a mouse for my laptop and another one for my big screen in the back and check the driver, the driver status is where it starts. So wireless network configuration, that's the page I'm on, on the wiki Arch Linux. And then they go to check the driver status. Okay, fine. Let's go for Control alt t so list me all the PCI stuff, so the stuff that's in my system. That's all this, right? And if you just want to know the K version, then you get only, was I typing it correctly? Minus K, that's a lot to have minus K. Yeah, it is. So, Where is my wireless thingy? It's so much. This is actually better for me. So I have a Broadcom PC4322, an A, and B, and a G, and an N wireless LAN. So that's the one I'm using. There is no LAN cable hooked up, which is this one then Ethernet controller, NVIDIA Corporation MCP. 7.9 Ethernet. So I should remember this guy, BCM4322. Okay, hooking up via network, wireless. If it's recognized, then you're in good luck and you have sheer luck in the sense that the kernel figured out what you have and that everything is set up right. You can actually, um, no, you can't do that yet, Eric. So let's follow the wiki, let's see. So we have found our name, right? Also check the output of IP link. Okay. Mm -hmm. So what can we learn from this? That this is my name for my wireless adapter or my um, NIC network interface card. Okay, so that's the name, the system gives it that name. Okay. Uh, then they say IP, a link, set, and then the interface. W, L, and a P, and then four, and an S, and then it's always a question. Is it a zero, is it an O? Really don't know, I'm guessing it's an O. Let's become sudo. If you see things like that, permission not uh, permitted, operational permitted to deny it, stuff like that, become sudo. 
Okay, sudo ip link set. I guess that worked. And this is an O. Could not find device. And this is a capital O. Cannot find device. So basically, it's a zero. Okay, so now we know it's a zero. What's next? For example, assuming uh, uh, so, uh, if you get an error message, no, nope, no error message got. You have, they are now talking about kernel stuff. Grab it, grab to find uh, the message. I need to figure out where my, it's a Mac laptop, right? Keyboard's a little bit different. This thing, and grab me the firmware. That's it. No, not included here. Check kernel messages for firmware being loaded. Nope. Those now relevant outputs. Then they type something like the message. Of this thing, and then grab I W L. Wi-Fi. Is there something in here? Nope. Not available either. Keep scrolling on on the page. Installing driver and firmware. We don't need to do that. It's, it's figured. It found it out. And there are some utilities. Wireless tools. Wireless tools is installed. Easiest way to know something is installed on Arch Linux or on the Arch Linux is remove it. <laughs> if you can remove it, it's installed. Super simple, right? So wireless tools, we have that. They are talking about IW. You can remove it. You can't, well, you, can, you can't remove it, but it's installed. It says you can't, because it exists. Uh huh? That's uh, another message. Let's, ah oh, yeah, update. Yeah, I got it. I've never been online with this guy. This is a proper um, clean installation, LXQT. Never actually went wireless or, or, or with LAN. So there is no Pacman minus SYUU. I mean, Pacman never has seen the internet. There's no database yet. So that's a good, um, good exercise, actually. So IW, fine. It exists, IW. And then WPA. Is installed as well and IWD is installed as well since I can no I, IW is installed the package is called IWD we can maybe check it this way as well not sure yep okay that is installed and it's for wireless devices. Yep, that's the thing we need. Close. So all the packages that are required are in Arch Linux. Good. Uh, check. Then there's a lot of uh, things they're going to say. Getting link status, device, VLAN, etc. I'm not going to do that. Scrolling down. Get the name of the interface. Not a command we can try out. IW device, but we know our device already, WP4S0, check the status of the device, something else we could do, we better copy paste this thing over, so control shift C to control shift V, Not connected. All right, agreed. You can get this information, etc. Activate the interface. I believe we've done that already. That was this thing. Activate and set inter. Oh, set interface up. That's something else. So, a new command. Link. Set. The end. Then your interface. Up. No error message means good news. Activate interface, that's what I've done. 
we can ask the IP link show interface interface is always your thing so my copy paste so that's that we got the same result online on the wiki page um, it should say up somewhere I believe oh yeah there it is multicast up lower up okay good we're up that's what it says the access points where should I connect to and then interface that's this I should scan let's see without less always these the need to have pseudo permissions so <laughs> that's why they put less behind it and that's this and less all right so what's in the air that's what we're looking at what are the wireless uh, possibilities how do they call it in english the wireless mm. channels yeah maybe so this is all in the air fine not helping uh, escape control c quit <laughs> q <laughs> okay so discover access points we've done that set operating mode maybe don't think we need that But what about this Wi-Fi menu? I think that's probably better. At this point in time, everything is up. I need to connect. And Wi-Fi menu is this thing that gives me, oh, gives me more help. I need help. Oh. Scanning for networks. Exactly. Hola. That's, it's hope you can read it, but I can now. So we have all these neighbors that are in the air. But this is mine. Enter a name for the device, that's okay. Password, don't look, look away. Oh yeah, I should stop recording. <laughs> you already know one word. <laughs> okay, that one letter, that will be fine. Connecting failed. Do you want to keep the connection? Why did it fail? Did I do the typo? No, I'm gonna say. Doing it again. Second trial to get my password in there. Okay. Ready to wait pinging, but that does not seem to do the trick. Um, how should we proceed now? Good question. Good question. All right, I got something to look at. There seems, seems to be a system CTL status thingy. So there is a status that I can ask it seems for this new thing that I've made this guy no that's not the sign that's not the sign that's the sign um, without s Eric that one Failed. No, you shouldn't fail. You should be enabled. Or enable, enabled, enable, enable. Uh, have no installation config. Okay. Problem is, I don't hope that I should be 
restarting this stuff then my video is going to break uh -huh. is already up he says the interface of network profile is already up fail to start networking that's good that it's up but we're not connected so we should be able to connect okay now you've missed all the fun I'm online without clicking on this, this button of course I am connected to Netgear 36 now what I've done so and um, we have here this asterisk in front of it so it's uh, like two meters to my left <laughs> yeah, so the, the range here is okay but um, back and quit I've been looking around in the services but it was not the service and, uh, and it didn't reboot anything like that what I did do is um, go to the I can actually show you now I have internet <laughs> I can show you now on the internet the page we were talking about that there is how I wanted to connect to the I wanted to connect basically right so on the page I was looking for a way to connect to the right uh, well network arch what was it network configuration Wi-Fi configuration that's where we started, I think. Wi-Fi config, let's see what we get. Didn't type wiki in front of it, but we're there. Thanks to Bing. So I was reading all of this, and then I control find, connect. That's what I wanted to do, to connect. Then I just jumped around to see what I could do, and then here it is already a reference to the network manager which is this thing we're using it everywhere so that's good you can actually do the command in in the terminal which I, I, I would find difficult because I don't know my ESD exactly and uh, my key yes I know my key but we have to figure that out then but it was no need to figure it out if where did I get the idea connect to an access point was it here that I had the idea? Let's go on the other screen back. Damn it. Can't find it again. So let's hop, hop about. Here it is. This is where I got the idea. You have a WPA personal, right? Nobody has Wi-Fi that's unprotected. Some, something must be there. WEP or WPA2. And it says either you do this or you do that or you connect and I thought hey yeah why not use our own network manager. Clicking here gives us the information about the network manager. Did I follow this link again? I think so. And there control find connect hop about edit the connection no nope. further along checking connectivity maybe I did something else here I was searching for another word or maybe I just looked at this thing is it somewhere in the middle anyway I was I found this idea nm 2 nm 2 e two pages that's it I did find something else I'm, did, I'm, I'm totally lost here I wanted to retrace my steps but unfortunately I can't so it's in the arch wiki where I have got the idea to actually launch this application which is part of our network manager if you go and have a look always interesting to 
included in these videos. Use Spamac AOR to get to know your machine. What's put where? NM2E, the command line interface. And this is the two user interface, more graphical kind of look. Anyway, close. And this gives us this strange screen. Edit the connection, activate the connection, says system host. So I took a look, I took a look, and it was not there. This was not present at that point in time. And then you have to move about with backspace, 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 back. And then activate the connection. I got a list. Maybe we can do it again. No. I got a list to select it. Yeah, that's what I got. And then we have this long list. Selected that one. And then suddenly this little icon just popped into life. And meaning we've internet. So we can finally update our system. And that's how anyway I got online. I hope it may help somebody. But again, the tip, I'm not a specialist, the tip hook up your cables never had any issues with my ethernet devices so my network interface cards where you plug in the cable it's almost always functions it's where you are in Arco Linux D for instance and it's all black and you definitely want to have a Wi-Fi connection then maybe you'll need this but normally it's just all good when you plug in a cable and then uh, when you have in a graphical environment do your thing then with all these helpers these are helpers right they help you connect to the internet all right that's it for me i hope i help somebody with this video and uh, cheers for now